Hey YouTube, thanks for checking out Leibovu. Today I'm out in the garage, kind of cold, and I'm going to do a review on something that I just put on a snowblower, and it's just fantastic. So if you have an ignition problem, I want you to see this. This is the snowblower that I've been working on. It's an old Toro. This is from the late 80s, and this thing is just a killer snowblower. It works really well. The customer brought it in, though, and he had a problem that it shut off and it would not start again. After checking into it, I found that the carburetor was okay and it was getting fuel, so I went to the spark plug and pulled the lead off and found out even when the key was on, there was no spark. I went ahead and troubleshot and checked that the key switch was working, and it was. I found out that it was this little device, and it's an ignition module. Now there's a magneto coil that's underneath the blower housing, and that could have been causing the problem. However, I wanted to check this first because it required a lot less labor to pull off all that blower housing to get to the coil. I found that this wasn't working by replacing it with what I'm going to suggest. This is the item I suggest. It's an Oregon 33-053. It's a universal ignition module. This is what the module looks like once mounted. This one used to be mounted in that spot. This uses one screw that holds the module to the blower housing and uses one wire that runs to the initial wire that was being used that runs to the magneto that's up on the flywheel. This right here cost $190 to replace from the dealer. This costs less than $20. They do the same thing. This one was designed specifically for this engine being used in this application. This one here is more of a wide range of uses. It's still a very effective ignition module to run this engine. This little item is really nice. It will replace points and it will also, as in this case, replace an ignition module that's defective. It will work on nearly any air-cooled engine as long as it's not a battery-powered ignition. Not a battery start system, but a battery-powered ignition. It will work on negative ground and positive ground. I'm going to put the link down below. Click the link. You're going to get it shipped to you right away. If you like this video, click the like thumbs up button or click subscribe. You're going to be really happy with this. I love these little things and for under 20 bucks it's always nice to have one on the shelf. And my customer is going to be very happy in this case because I have one on the shelf just for this reason. Thank you very much. I appreciate you watching. Bye.